All right. So welcome to our free webinar, 30 Minutes to Profits for summertime fun and get your glow on. And I have to say that Danielle and I have been chatting for, you know, the last 45 minutes and I just like learned so much from this woman. It's amazing how it doesn't matter how long you've been in the industry, there's always something that you can learn. So if you don't know who I am, I am Maxine Drake, and I am the founder of the Esthetician Business Academy and the Beauty Business Summit coming up in October. And I have Danielle Wachowski with me, and she is the Director of Education for Skin Smooth Pro. And what a wealth of information you are. And we're going to dive into some really fun stuff. But before I have to tell you, she gave me a big reveal. Can I tell everyone what the big prize is at the end? Yes. So Skin Smooth Pro wants to give a $500 value. We're going to talk a little bit more about that um, at the end of this webinar. But we want to give you a ton of value. We want to go through a little bit of training on this incredible service and treatment really and Danielle well I mean thank you thank you for doing this with me oh. and and I have to also say that I am so excited that Skin Smooth Pro is one of the Beauty Business Summit sponsors and Danielle Wachowski is going to be a keynote speaker this year and just by this snippet of what we talked about the last 45 minutes I cannot wait to hear your keynote like you're just on fire girl so welcome and um, I'll let you go ahead and get your screen share ready. Okay. And I'm going to, hey, Denise. Denise is like, wow, I'll handle the chat box. You, you handle your, wow, you see you're a pro now at it. Look at you. <laughs> boom, boom, boom. See, that's why we have a little practice. You're a, you're a brilliant, brilliant coach. So thank Aww. you. <laughs> I'm not a techie. 30 minutes to profit. So I think our attendees and, you know, tell me if I'm wrong, you guys, are you not excited to like learn how you can maximize your time this summer, your client's time this summer, and really bring in some awesome summer revenue? How many people on the webinar right now have a slowdown during summer? I'd really like to know because you're in for a treat. <laughs> with how to market this. We're gonna go through how to market. She's gonna give you some amazing tips. She's just an amazing coach. I'm sorry, I'm just like going on. I'm like a big Danielle fan. Oh. I have a girl crush on you, that's all. It's so great to be here, Maxine. Right, right back at you. So good to be here. All right, so, okay, very quiet. Yep, it slows down, especially August. All right, so let's go. What do we got here? Okay, so Skin Smooth Pro is um, it's a dynamic American company uh, that started back in 2010 when I just felt like there weren't affordable devices that were of medical grade. So this, this device company, um, in, they're based out of California. All the parts, all the design uh, comes out of the United States and the motors are brilliant. There's two medical oscillating motors inside at one point. Um, when I was helping out with the design, we, we left a machine on for six months. It does not overheat. It does not, it's just a well-built little seven pound tank. Um, we modeled it after the most expensive devices. Um, of course, we, sh we shopped all over the world on the internet and we found that these cheap uh, diamond tip machines contained motors for toys. So we, we definitely wanted to give an affordable machine uh, but with the best parts available, the, the most, you know, quality parts. We don't want this machine to break down ever. So that's why it has a lifetime warranty. Most companies just don't give you a lifetime. They give you a one-year warranty. So this is an American company that gives you a lifetime warranty. We have advanced education. In fact, the current owner um, is a marvelous, marvelous esthetician. She is a good colleague of mine. She's brilliant and, um, you know, a hardworking esthetician full time. And we're both collaborating on protocols and innovating new procedures and making sure that everyone is um, trained in proper protocols and, and, and actual um, technique. Because it's, this is a device that is safe um, in the hands of someone that ha that's had really good technique training. And I feel the schools are still 
A lot of them are still doing crystal. A lot of them aren't really teaching technique. Um, a lot of the teachers um, perhaps have, are cosmetologists or maybe they don't have a lot of experience in you know, a busy medical environment or spa environment. And Lydia and I, well, we have between us, we have, gosh, probably 60 years of experience. Um, you know, I love, I, I'm sorry to interrupt, but I don't know, you, tell me if you guys like, you know, please chime in in the chat, but as an esthetician and previous spa owner myself, you know, exceptional advanced education and that continuing education and that so support and love from a company is so important. I think we're losing it. Um, that exceptional customer service where, you know, tell me if you guys feel the same because, you know, is that important to you when you're partnering with a company to get that continuing education, to get the support, to get protocols, and to um, feel like you're not just like sold a product or a, a piece of equipment and now they're they're done with you, you know, and I, I just love that. I love the heart and soul behind that because it, everyone's saying it's partnership and the company is very important to me. Absolutely. It's everything extremely important. So thank you. Cause I feel the same way. I'm like, I'm not high maintenance, but I just expect, you know, it, that, that, that exceptional customer service and follow through after a purchase. So thank you. And oh. the fact that it's not built in China. Thank you. Yeah, absolutely. Well, and I think that our mission with Skin Smooth Pro is we wanted a device that was affordable, a device that a solo practitioner could pay off within a matter of weeks, because your return on investment does not happen until you have cleared, clearly paid off your machine. So if your machine is $30,000, it's going to take you a very long time to realize any profits. You're basically laboring for free until you pay off that very expensive device. So we wanted the device to be something that you could literally pay off in a month or less. I've had people pay it off in a couple of weeks just based on selling packages, pre-selling packages to purchase their machine cash. Yep. So that's important. Um, but yeah, it's uh, getting into the next slide, you know, this is a very high return on your investment. So ROI is return on investment and low CPT, that's cost per treatment. It's not just, you know, paying off the machine, but how much is it going to cost you to run this service? This is a $1 cost per treatment. When you paid off that machine, th these tips, they are, they last you about 40 services and the, the little filters that go in them are very, very, um, very, very inexpensive, but what it works out to be is about a dollar per treatment. So those are the tips along the bottom there? Of yeah. the screen? There, well, we have several. These are just some examples of a face tip. Uh, that's, that's face tip. We also have a nose tip. We have three different face tips, fine, medium, and coarse. We have nose tips, eye tips, or what we call the detail tips, where you can do the vermilion border and outside the orbital ridge, or you can do details of the face. Crease okay. of the nose, of the chin, uh, maybe the upper lip a little bit. Um, and then the big one is the body tip. So the very, um, the one next to the, uh, the, the third picture there, that is a body tip. And they come in small, medium, and large as well. So if you're doing legs or backs or arms, you know, large body parts, then we do have tips for that as well. I, I mean, you know, I, there's so much out there. Yeah. And, you know, so I'm just very curious, how does Skin Smooth Pro like differentiate from other diamond tip? Well, we there? were modeled against, you know, there's a, there's a company that was very, very expensive and we wanted to be as good or better than that mm -hmm. device at a mm -hmm. price that estheticians could afford because it was yeah. actually manufactured for doctors, you know, and doctors mm -hmm. won't even look at a machine if it's not uh, very expensive. So this was designed for the esthetician because I believe that when the diamond tip first came out, they, they bypassed the beauty market. They went straight to the medical market. So that's why beauty schools across the country to this day are still doing crystal because the, the manufacturer, the original manufacturer of diamond tip went straight for the doctors. Well, I was shocked uh, in 2010 when I saw this and, and I couldn't believe that people were still using something so archaic as crystal when we had something safer, better, you know, more 
effective, you know. Yeah, it's, well, it's funny because um, Karen just asked, wait, why are crystal machines on their way out? You guys, I just learned something really big. Um, please share with the attendees what we were talking about earlier today about um, the mechanical exfoliation and the chemical, because I learned something new. Well, you know, the first thing we should really establish is that particles uh, are very controversial. Uh, particles in the air, particles, and not so much for your client, but, and of course for your client, but we're really, the, what we're really afraid of is what is the clinician or what is the esthetician inhaling? And is how often is she or he inhaling? We don't think that it's safe. And we haven't thought this for a very long time. In fact, the owner of Skin Smooth Pro worked for probably the largest dermatology, oldest dermatology practice, and he refused to bring in Crystal because of the research and um, the studies that were showing dangerous you know, um, inhalation. And he said, I'll have no part of that. And I think that's, that's really why Diamond is still the gold standard because it's particle free. So we don't wanna be inhaling anything. We don't wanna scratch the cornea of someone's eye. If something gets into someone's eyes, we don't want to have to clean up a mess. I mean, there's a time component with crystal where it gets very, very labor intensive because you've got crystal everywhere. There's an expense to crystal that is so high when you think about how archaic it is. So there's a health component. There's a risk for your health that we just feel like when you've got an alternative, it's like the big, huge cell phone. We've got a small smartphone now. This is the smartphone. Um, this is clean and effective. It's low cost. It's safe. There is no chemical like a, a, a crystal, right, is generally very drying to the skin. And that's why back in the 90s, we loved it because for, if you had oily skin, it's, it was great for oilier skins. But we are, we are in the new you know, generation of everybody's using retinols and everybody's using acids. And our customers are way more compromised than they ever were back in the 90s. So we need to have machines and uh, treatments that uh, will respect the integrity of the barrier and maintain, you know, barrier repair, keeping that barrier functioning. And so I think anytime you use a chemical or anything that could, that could be, that's, that can alter the state of the skin, especially during the summertime, I would back away from that. I'd be really, I'd be really cautious. This is a chemical free way to exfoliate the skin. So. Okay. I, I'm, I'm an esthetician. I was a little embarrassed that oh, I was like, wait yeah. a minute, <laughs> you know, and tell me if you guys are with me too, if you thought the same thing, don't leave me in the lurch <laughs> thinking I'm the only one. But like, I thought that even because I was, I use crystals, like the big pain in the butt for me was it always got my client's ears. It was yes. all over the place whatever. But, um, I did, I thought it was a manual manipulation or manual exfoliation. I didn't know that it was chemical until it, still has a, it does. It has I a dry know. effect on the skin. So we don't think of it like, like sodium chloride is table salt. Um, so the, the conundrum, the, the conundrum crystals or the crystals that they were using still had an effect on the, on the skin. It still had a drying effect. And so we just try to eliminate that because we're only Sodium using chloride. products. Yeah, it I mean, is a chemical. It, it is. It, it does have an effect on the skin. And um, it is, a, it's, even though it's like a sandblasting, and that's, I think, the easiest for all of us to understand, um, it's still, we're, we're basically dragging that material, that particle across the skin, and it does tend to dry the skin. Now, there are other particles that are not drying, but they're still particles that can be inhaled. There's still particles that can get in your ears or your nose or the, you know, in, in the client's mouth, in their hair, um, in the room. So I like to just kind of first say, look, let's, let's talk about non-particle solutions. Or, so Stacy has a question that might be like, I think you're on the roll of it. And she's like, um, do you get the same level of exfoliation with crystals versus diamond? Because she feels like, honestly, she feels like crystal is better. Uh -huh. My question to Stacy is, has she tried diamond? So that's my question to you, Stacy. But can question. you shed some light on that? Yeah. The, here's what I love about diamond. Okay. If you can see the picture of the, um, you know, in the corner there, in the bottom right-hand oh, yeah. corner, that's yeah. a tip. That is a tip 
um, sorry, that is a filter. That is a black filter that just came out of a facial diamond tip. That is dead skin material. All of that white stuff you're looking at, that white cakey stuff, that is dead skin. That's why I love the black filters. Um, and that's a tweezer, that's a needle nose tweezer holding that black filter for the camera. So what I love about this is yes, it does get dead skin off amazingly well. The client can see it on the tip, sorry, the filter, but she can, or he can also see it on their skin um, beautifully. It turns the skin from, you know, shiny dead skin to a very matte, silky, matte silk texture. So you know you're getting a great exfoliation. Now, when you're doing it with crystal, you've got all that crystal material mixed with dead skin. So how does the client know how much really came out? Or, you know, it's really hard to qual uh, quantify it. But when you can mm -hmm. pull the filter out of the tip, you certainly have, you know, proof that it works. Oh, that's pretty cool. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Now, if you're grossed out by it, then I wouldn't be, you know, pointing oh that out. Gosh. Most People of us are doing like their dirty water and all kinds of stuff now. So <laughs> I don't think we're not grossed out. We we do extractions, exactly. right? Exactly. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So. But the thing I love, I think I'll point out to anybody who's still doing crystal is um, in California, where where I teach a lot and help a lot of people make a very good living. We're in a state that the medical spa rules, the nurses and doctors running very, very lucrative uh, medical spa businesses who are, you know, who are shooting lasers and they're blending different modalities, radio frequency. All we have in California are chemical peels, microcurrent, LED, and, and microderm in a nutshell. I mean, those are the big, the big four. And so what I teach is how do you blend these modalities to, you know, get dynamic results that they wouldn't get if they went to the medical spa because the medical spa people aren't necessarily estheticians and they don't know the nuances and the crafting and the art form of blending modalities. So it's not just about microderm, it's about utilizing a safe chemical free uh, inert so that the little material on the diamond tip is inert. It will not change the chemistry of your skin. It will just uh, remove dead skin cells safely so that you can uh, stack or blend modalities such as enzymes and different chemical peels and all kinds of fun things. Presenterate is another one that I love to use right now for infusing after microderm. The other thing also that's different from uh, the the crystal, I'm sorry, the crystals versus the diamond tip, well, I just know from, is the high vacuum pressure. Exactly. And I, and I do remember the Thank first you. time that I kind of bursted a little vessel on someone yeah. and I was like mortified as an esthetician because you're like they're on your table and you're like there to help uh -oh. them more beautiful <laughs> but that high vacuum so that you don't have that no diamond tip is low vacuum pressure it's in fact everything you've learned if you learned on crystal you have to like just forget about all of that you have to relearn that okay. this is completely opposite we're going to do low vacuum pressure it's going to be like a a very gentle, but yet cardio yoga. We're gonna bring up oxygen through blood flow uh, gently. We're gonna brace the skin, not, and that's the other thing with Crystal, we were over bracing. We were making sure the skin was super, super taut because we needed it to be because the vacuum pressure was so darn high. And right. that, that material was coming out at a really high pressure or it would get everywhere if it was too low. So right. this is opposite. This is low vacuum pressure. This is no material spraying out at you. This is you, you know, adjusting your technique based on the, on the skin. So I teach, okay, in certain areas, you're going to do two inch strokes. In certain areas, you're going to do a half inch stroke. But, okay. And this is how you're going to brace the skin. There's a one finger break, brace. There's a two finger brace. There's a way to do this. Um, so it is, it's just, it couldn't be safer. This, there, this is a way where if you don't know someone's skin, but you know good technique, you can do this as a first timer facial without any chemicals. You use a very, very gentle cleanser. Um, you give them an instant exfoliation and then you basically skin type them and get them on a program without any chemicals, without any chemical peels or even enzymes. People can be allergic to enzymes big time. This is, this is a non-threatening way to get to know someone and remove their dead skin cells and give them an instant gratification service.
So what are the contraindications? You know, there's always some, you know, like what are the contraindications for diamond tip then? Well, because this is, uh, it's easier to tell you who you can't use okay, okay. On than who yeah. you can. Because basically pretty much everybody that walks through your door can have this unless they are under the care of a, of a, of a doctor for a very serious autoimmune condition. Um, if someone is healthy, if, they, if they're if they healing well, if but if they're not, you don't want to do it. If they have open lesions, if they have a sunburn, um, if they have some type of vascular condition or they're, you know, an autoimmune condition where they're just not healing, you never yeah. want to do a chemical peel on those people. It's basically the Anything. same as a chemical yeah. peel. Um, it's pretty simple. Where, where, where people get in trouble with microdermis, they are not doing proper technique. They're not bracing the skin properly. I've seen a doctor on YouTube brace the skin here while he's doing the, the service over here. You know, when really it should be, we all know that these two hands work together throughout the entire service. And so you're doing it and maintaining the integrity of the skin. Um, so it's just about, you know, proper, proper education. Um, but it's, it's, this is really something that I would do on just about everybody, men, even, you know, your, your grade one and two acne, your teenagers that have so much built up congestion and hyper, you know, hyperkeratolytic, and you just need to get that dead skin off. Um, we can yeah. even do this on a uh, very, very gently with yeah. tiny little baby strokes. We can do it on someone with, with rosacea. Trust me, I've done it um, a lot. But again, yeah. it comes down to the practitioner. How much confidence does she or he have? How much education do they have? So when at Skin Smooth Pro, we really, really want to make sure that everybody is confident and understands and never goes above their level of comfort um, because it's all about safety. And, and it's all about this service. This, this webinar is about how to keep people healthy, safe, smooth, and beautiful all summer long without any chemicals um, or downtime. You know, and I love it because I think we have a lot of, and I don't want to go down the rabbit hole of how many things are out there now that's not within our scope that people are doing. And I love that this treatment, you know, because like you said, California is the litmus test of like your, your poor state gets like, you got slammed. Like I remember when LED and, you know, know. and it's just like, so <laughs> it's one of these treatments that we can pretty much, I think there's one or two states. Is anybody on where their state where, where you cannot, where microdermabrasion is not within your scope? I'd like to know. Yeah. I, I thought there was one or two. You if it is. But yeah. I can't, you know, I mean, even dermaplaning. Um, yeah, we cannot know. do that. In Cal I mean, I was, I was an Arizona esthetician so at first, so we were able to do so many things. And then I came to California and no, there's not much we can do. So, yeah. uh, but we can do great things. I mean, we, we have, we're a populous state. We have high rents. It's a high cost of living. We're up against the, the medical board. We're up against the nursing lobby who want to do what we do. So my job is to make California estheticians very, very successful, profitable, um, and learning the art form of stacking, utilizing everything that's legal and safe and wonderful and how to do it properly. Um, skin type, skin analysis. I do a lot of skin analysis training because I think in 600 hours of school, how do you possibly learn skin analysis? It's an advanced course. It's something that you need to be mentored uh, from an older esthetician or someone who's been in this in, in the market a lot longer than you have maybe that can you can shadow and who can show you hey this is what we're looking at or what do you see um, let me hey, listen you know Danielle I don't think it matters how long I mean I've been in the industry 30 years and I learned something new from you oh well me too I you know I mean like so, so I think we just need to always we you know we, learning. you know just being that open vessel of like hey i don't know it all and no, there's we like, never will <laughs> we michigan, never will <laughs> um crystal wrote one of my girls uh michigan you can't do microderm unless you're under a doctor a doctor mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. so you can be an esthetician under a doctor okay okay yeah but like oregon you know is limiting you no know, dermaplane microneedling so there you know so that's where you know the the diamond tip and you know would be a great alternative for you um, yeah, Alina said she would love to attend your skin analysis class. Hmm, maybe we should change your keynote at the summit. I know, sure. I, you know, we anything's possible. It's five okay. months, <laughs> months away. 
I think just, that is the keys. Yeah. So what's, what's on your sl uh, screen right now? I, here's the other thing. And please tell me if you guys thought the same thing too. And that is like, gosh, you can't do microderm in the summer because I can't remember who taught me that. And I think I was misinformed as I'm learning from, well, if you're using the sodium chloride crystals, I don't think it's as safe to do in the summer. Now that I know like, wow, that's really not a mechanical exfoliation. That's really Well, it's still mechanical. It is I mean, mechanical, it's but it's, it's both. Yeah, it, it, well, it has a side effect. Yes, it, you're right. It has a side effect so, and it's drying yeah. and it also, you know, it's salt, right? So like you said, and so now I'm like, whoa, this is something. So let's get into the profitability, like, and, and share and talking about how this is a safe treatment for summertime and what we can get do to get these girls excited about generating some revenue for the summer as we begin well, summer right now. We all know that our clients are busy and their yep. kids are out of school. They're planning yep. vacations. We all can agree that our, our services will be, People are going to be cutting them shorter. They're perhaps going to be missing the services. So I feel that, you know, if we can get them in for a passport to three treatments that are low cost, that allow them to purchase their retail. Summer is about retail. It's about making sure they've got their home care for their trips. Um, they're going to buy home care. Let's get them to buy it from you. They should be buying that from you. This is a great time for you to have a lot more fun, quick conversations with your clients. Uh, getting them excited about their their um, their travels, getting them ready for their parties. Uh, microderm on the body is a wonderful way to get ready for those summertime parties and barbecues. Um, and when you're selling them, hey, I've got a pack of three. Um, it's good for June, July, and August. You can use them as you need to use them. They're 30, 35 minutes long. And you get, you know, into our raffle for such and such or and you get our travel kit with that. But you do need to purchase that in a series of three. But we're not going to book it now. You don't have to book it now. Um, but you do need to pay for it now. Um, that if you can get them to come back and they've already pre-purchased and they're, they're going to come back, you're going to get those retail sales. If your services are lower priced, you're going to sell more retail. If your services are quicker and under 45 minutes you're gonna sell more retail. The longer they're on the bed, the more relaxed they become, the, the studies show that your retail sales are diminished by how relaxed and how zen-like they are. So if they go into a deep, deep state of relaxation, they're not gonna to wanna to think real hard and heavy about what they have to do. But if you have 35, 30, 30 to 35, maybe 40 minute treatments where you're getting them excited and they can see those results happening and they're excited about that new vitamin C serum or, you know, uh, whatever product you're you're recommending for them to keep looking beautiful and healthy all summer long They're gonna want to go home right now and do that They're gonna want to buy those products and you know go home and get that done So time is stressful for clients I think when the kids are out of school and that's when we really have to focus on hey I don't want to be a time factor to you, but we still need to get your skin worked out We need to do that 30 minute workout once a month So I'm not gonna tie you down right now, but I want I'd really like to see you purchase that passport of three um, skin treatments. Uh, they're quick, they're easy, and um, let's keep your skin safe and beautiful and healthy all summer long. Because you know how they glow are when they come and back. Go. Yes. That's, that's great glow marketing. And go. Glow and go. And, and, yeah. Glow and go. You know, no stress. This is not going to take a lot of your time, but I do want to get that skin off and I want to get you some product. So. You know, they're spending a lot of money too. Summer is when they are just, they're seeing their money go out the door for kids events and travel. So um, keeping those services, no stress, no downtime, safe, um, affordable, so that they can purchase their home care, um, you know, and keep their skin looking beautiful and buying their home care from you, that's gonna mean more ROI for you because you're not going to be laboring doing long, long, long drawn out massages. You're going to see more people per day. Your revenue will go up. Your retail revenue is going to go up. Your service revenue will actually go up. You'll be seeing more people per day, more referrals, more, you know, results. Um, it's kind of a winning, you know, when Nordstrom, I just want to throw this out there. Nordstrom is, is one of the, they spend millions on marketing and research. 
And when Nordstrom turned all of their department store spas into mini treatments and express spa treatments, I knew that is who our customer, that's, that's the litmus test of where our customer's going. And they want to have this option. I'm not saying yeah. that the spa facial is gone. No way. I get spa facials uh, whenever I can. Um, yeah. I love them. But as a business model, you know, really getting good at offering stressed out people or people who don't like massage or people who just, I can't think about laying down for an hour. Are you joking? Having a <laughs> menu, <laughs> you know, where it's it's not stressful for me and I can still look pretty. I can still look good. Um, I was in a spa once and a, and a busy woman comes in with her Chanel handbag and her Hermes scarf. And she's like, do you have extraction facials? I just want to, I just need extractions. And the, I, it was one of my biggest accounts and I'm, I'm waiting for the director to come out and meet with me. But I was overhearing this conversation and the front desk gal said, no, I'm sorry. We don't have extraction facials. But we have the hour, you know, we do have a, our shortest service would be the hour. And it does, I don't have an hour. I have 30 minutes. And it was that epiphany that started this whole thing for me back in 2000 and shoot. Back then it was probably, yeah, 2009 when that happened. And I thought, oh my gosh, we really do. We're, these are, this is a powerful woman. She's on her way to San Francisco. She had 30 minutes. She, her skin was a mess. You know, she's got lots of money and not a lot of time. So for some people, yeah. it's about time. It, I think it has become that. I'm, you know, even in my coaching group, it's like time management, like, oh my gosh, like I can't, like, it's just, you know, I think it's just harder and harder. We live in a very distracted world and busy moms out there. I mean, let's face it. Most of us that are women, we do it all. You know, we're running the, the business and you know, cooking dinner for the kids and running the household. And, and so, so is our client. And so, you know, by like giving back their time, you know, mm -hmm. so I love the glow and go and Stacy asks, which I think is on your next slide anyway, pricing uh, recommendations or it's coming up. Okay. Yeah. So oh. we'll get to that in a minute. Yeah. The, this, this is, this slide is just about the, you know, all of the benefits of a diamond tip. You can do congested skin. You can do hyperkeratosis or keratosis pilaris on the body. It stimulates fibroblasts, which stimulate collagen. Um, it enhances the penetration of your topicals. All of the home care you have them on, it's just going to mean that they work better. Um, it's great for fine lines and wrinkles, um, superficial acne scars, photo aging. Um, it's just, it's a given that it's good for most people. Um, again, time is money. We've already really talked about this. These are um, before travel, before the big party. There, is, there are no chemicals with this. So I've literally done brides on their wedding day. Um, Let's see here, lower cost per treatment, chemical free exfoliation, bundling. We've talked about bundling um, three treatments for the summer. That way you've ensured that they are gonna come back. You've given them an incentive such as a, um, we're gonna go over discounts, right, Maxine, at the end. We're gonna talk about how we can actually um, price this out. But what was the question that your client just asked again? Oh, just pricing recommendations. Oh, okay. Okay. Because I'm not a fan of discounting. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. I, yeah, I don't know if you know that about me. <laughs> no, I don't like discounting. I don't like doing specials. I don't like upselling through the facials, um, you know, nickel and diming. I don't do any of that. Um, so, but yes, if, if a person pre-buys from me, if they give me, if they pre-book with me, that means I have three times the cash I, I would have had if they had saved their money and waited to pay me next month and the month after. So I have what I call a rack rate. So let's say I have a microderm, it's a hundred dollar microderm, but if they purchase three right now, they're going to get it at, you know, if they buy a, a series of three, I'm going to give them some, some form of a, a break because they're putting cash in my business right now. And I know they're not going to go do a group on somewhere else. You know, they're going to come back. They've got those two pre bet booked. And what I love about pre-booking, when they come back for that second or third, it's already paid for. So they're, they're way more interested in purchasing retail. They have a lot more money to spend. Um, they're not concerned about the, pre, the, the, the treatment price. They've already paid. Um, so it's kind of nice. Um, so anyway, uh, where, are we, where are we? What's the raffle of package um, monthly for clients? Tell me, talk about, because that's like a little bit of marketing there, right? A little bit. And you're the marketing expert, but I have learned a couple of fun things along the way. Like yeah. if you purchase an incentive to get them to pre-book, right? They're going to go into the monthly raffle. Or if they refer three friends, they're going to get 
uh, into the raffle. So, you know, every time they refer people, they're going to get into my monthly raffle. So I think having a monthly raffle um, is a great idea. If you guys aren't doing that, it does incentivize people to, um, if that's part of your um, client referral um, or your, your, um, I can't see. I love it because we're not giving something for every single referral. I know that we want to reward our clients, no. but not like, it's like, it's costing us. Right. So I love how you are rewarding it because somebody will be a winner and you know, whatever that raffle is, I'm sure it's a little something, maybe a product or something, who knows. Well, yeah, and that's the second one too is easy, like giving away, like if, when you purchase a passport for three, you're la you purchase a package on your last one, I'm going to do your hand and arms, you know, I'm yeah. going to throw that in. It doesn't take much time to do a quickie micro on the hand and arm at all. Yeah. And people love it. Yeah, I like it. I like that idea for referral too. That's really, that's good. I like it. Good. So it's just, you know, getting people to, to come in for shorter services since they're so, they're so um, busy and also men. I mean, men have been a really big growing market. Men love this treatment. They love that it's instant, you know, that it's like um, shaving for them. <laughs> you know, it's the beard is gone or getting your hair trimmed, cutting off the split ends. That's what diamond tip does. It gives you that instant uh, gratification of, of removing that dead skin and having, you know, the follicles, we talked about this earlier, where the, the follicles are, they're cone shaped. So by removing, you know, so many microns of skin of dead stratum corneum, the follicle opening will be smaller. You know, it's just, it's like cutting off split ends. So it's, again, it's a really great service to offer men and women, teenagers with lots of, you know, grade one or grade two acne, um, and it's safe. So here we find I, I was going to say, like, to get your men in, I'm like, it looks like a power tool. <laughs> oh, men love, yeah, men love tools. They love devices. They it love does. feeling something's going on. They don't, yeah, they love it. They love Is it microderm. safe to microderm someone who's a, a man who's just shaved? Well, that's a really good point. It's not yeah. safe to put, obviously, like when we're doing chemical peels and enzymes, no. Like we say, don't shave on the day of your, or the morning of your facial. So you're like, oh. Because they're always shaving, they're always exfoliating. So even if they don't shave that day, right, and they come in for an enzyme, that skin is still overly exfoliated compared to the rest of their face. We still have to make adjustments. With microderm being chemical free, oh my gosh, it's so in our control. It, we don't have to worry so much about going over that skin because it is not chemical. It's not high vacuum. It's, we can even choose the tip. So the tip could be fine, medium, or coarse. If I were afraid, I would use the fine tip. I would on just the shape yeah. portion and then the medium. Oh my God, that's brilliant. Yeah, you can customize. Okay, I hope that answers your uh, question, Michelle. That's and awesome. Also, the length of the stroke, too. In my training, I tell people look, where people get into trouble is I see them doing these really long strokes. It's unnecessary. I mean, two inch strokes are as, are as long as I would do because you want to do a thorough good job. You want to give that person a beautiful exfoliation and that I call it the yoga for the skin. You want to like really work on, you know, the blood flow, the circulation, the oxygen, the nutrition to the skin. Um, don't rush through this service. I think this is a really healthy, healthy service to really, and the people go to sleep and the skin smooth pro is so quiet, Maxine. I didn't even tell you oh how quiet this machine is it's like white noise people people just kind of nod off and go to sleep they love it so but they're not too relaxed because they still want to yeah. buy retail they okay do. oh yeah okay. we'll wake them up <laughs> I'm saying you know but oh you know what i was going to ask you because you said you got between 40 and 45 That's services right. per tip yes um so the hardest thing about diamond tip is knowing when is my tip ready to be thrown out when so is how do we know you know by looking at it. I mean, when you first, you know by looking at it, some people okay. actually keep track. They get, um, we have these containers where you can literally, okay, when it's, I would be happy to share that in more detail, but every single time you do a microderm, you need to use a little filter. So, you know, the vitamin cases, we've literally put 10 filters in all the little holes of the vitamin case. And when you get to, you know, when you get down to, okay, this tip is this, I'm on my 40th filter for this tip, then you know it's time to throw it out. 
but most people don't do that. They just look at it. If it looks like a dull knife in your kitchen, you need to either sharpen it or throw it out. Um, you want every service to be perfect. So I like my tools to be in excellent condition. And when they're this affordable, um, the tips average about $20 a, a tip. So okay. I want okay. them to be shiny. I want them to yeah. look, they will look dull. They won't be shiny. Um, okay, well, that's a good, very shiny. And then how do you sanitize them? You want to use a really firm uh, uh, brush, like a nail brush with antibacterial soap and hot water. And you want to make sure that any material is off, just like you would an extractor or any, any okay. um, yeah. implement. And then, mm -hmm. you know, rinse it, pat it, and put it in your disinfectant for the manufacturer's said period of time into right. your squat solution. And that's it. Um, no ultrasonic, no, no. Well, yeah, good question, Maxine. The ultrasonic, that will actually vibrate the material. It could vibrate the material off the tip. So we don't recommend ultrasonic. Okay. Um, you can autoclave if you actually are in a medical medical environment and you autoclave. Yes, you can. Um, but UV steril, sterilizers um, in the state of California, the board does not see those as a true steril sterilizer. They see it just as a, a yeah. box that holds clean and implements. True. So. <laughs> I think it's in many states. But yeah. um, Denise wants to know what are the post care um, product suggestions that go with what the promotion that you have listed. And by the way, I asked Denise, um, I asked um, Danielle if we could borrow the glow and go for the yeah. summer because I just love it. And I think you guys should borrow that because it's a really good name. <laughs> but oh, what good, kind of post good. care? Well, this is our opportunity to reiterate to our clients um, tyrosinase inhibitors okay so um, we want to keep those melanocytes in check uh, vitamin c hyaluronic acid peptide serums our beautiful moisturizers our organic sunscreens that are you know broad spectrum and based on zinc and titanium not chemical um, if we can um, yeah just the basics the, the real basics that they can go to the, the gym with the spot they can come from our spot and go straight to Mexico Hawaii wherever you know they're gonna go out in the Sun so I like to keep it simple for them and just say have fun this summer you know I don't want you to worry too much about anything so let's protect your skin um, from future UV pigmentation let's let's make sure that you're using a good um, pigment control product vitamin C hyaluronic, you know, all the basics, you know, and kind of back off a little bit from high, high percentages of retinoids and, and acids and stick with the enzymes and the hydrating masks. And just, I want them to have a fun, stress-free summer. I don't want to be their drill sergeant like I usually am um, with their home care. <laughs> yeah. Um, so as long as they come and work out with me once a month, for a minimum of 30 minutes. Um, and I, I could probably give them a regime that's three to four products that'll keep them safe and beautiful all summer long. So, and these pricing here, this is, this is just like for, um, purposes of learning here. Cause everyone is in di formula. <laughs> different. Yeah. It's our, what did I call it earlier? Uh, just in a formulaic example. Uh, yeah. If we, uh, yes. An example formula because yeah. we all live in different demographics. So, yeah. You know, someone that lives in San Francisco might charge something a little higher. Oh, yeah. You know, Absolutely. then, you know, so you kind of want to pay attention to your demographics. You don't necessarily have to match them, but you also, you know, want to be mindful of what your market can bear. Yes. And this, uh, yeah, I just, I just like to encourage, I remember a spa owner told me, Danielle, everything we sell is in a series. We sell manicures. In a I series. love it. And I'm like, you know what? That woman was so smart and she was out of the thousands of customers I've worked with over the last 20 years. She was one of the brightest bulbs out there. She knew that that is how you capture and keep your customers because it's expensive to get new customers. Right, Maxine? Amen, sister. It's more expensive to gain a new client and we're obsessed. That's a whole nother webinar, but <laughs> you know, it, it really is. So getting that repeat rolling out the red carpet, yes. having unbelievable hospitality, client service, you know, that customer service, just. Loving on those best customers, loving, knowing who your VIPs yes. are, wanting their friends, taking yeah. good care of them. Yeah. That's old school, man. I love that. That's, that's, that's what we got to do. So. 
So, 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 so you're recommending, and I like this too, because I recommend this as well. I don't necessarily like discounting, but what I love what you've put on the slide, I feel like we're two peas in a pod is that yeah. you always want to have the single session priced higher because we want to encourage that package. And then I love how you showed as an example with a post kit, whatever, you know, with the vitamin C, hyaluronic, you know, sun, sun protection, whatever's in there, um, you showed the value. So copy this or, you know, screenshot this slide, and this will be available for replay because I, th I love seeing bundles. I think they're very effective and people want to see the value. So if you're getting the go the glow and go with post kit for 239 and the value is 310 and you're saving 70 bucks that's, that's going to speak like that speaks more to a person than like oh 10 percent off or absolutely get, get to get one free like oh those are like no, 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 no. Like this works way better. Don't you think? Oh, I, I agree yeah. completely. Percentages do not equate to people, but dollars no. do. They yeah, do. So you, if you, they don't want to calculate. That's right. No. And I think if you're giving something, you should tell someone, Hey, I'm giving you a value here of $310 for, you know, really reiterate that, you know, this is an $80 mm -hmm. service or this is a a hundred dollar service that you're getting, you know, for yeah. eighty dollars. It's really that that really speaks volumes to people. Wow, I just saved twenty dollars. Now I can I can tip her that twenty dollars. Yes. You know, or what have you. Do we have a before and after? Yes, we do. So I'm this, dying. Okay, this I am a friend. Uh, back back when we were manufacturing these machines, she was um, a rep, a very 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 good rep with a very 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 large medical line. And I simply put her on, um, you know, a good regime at home. And then she had three micro uh, enzymes. So just a vitamin C enzyme with a one pass microderm. And that's just three. So it, I, did, I did give her a little bit of an enzyme with that, but it was a vitamin C enzyme, very safe um, and very effective. So it worked really, really well with her. I, I want you guys to take note of this before and after because I've seen some really good ones out there and some not so good ones out there. And what I love about this is you've really captured, you, when you're doing before and afters, you wanna make sure you get the same lighting, the same angle. I'm like, I don't know how she got this girl to wear the same lipstick, but. It's her lips, those are her lip color. She has very dark hair. If you can see her pigment, oh. She's got oh. a American Indian in her. She's, oh, she's very okay. dark. Her eyes are darker than yours. Her hair was darker than yours. So she had very beautiful pigment in her lips. Uh, it's it's a, a stunning finish. And how many treatments was this? She had three, but the caveat is I did use a vitamin enzyme with it. Vitamin okay. C enzyme. Okay. With it. Well. So it's not just a straight micro, um, but she was on a lot of good home care. So what I love about microderm is it's going to set you up for your home care working better. Your other tools and devices that you love, whether it's LED or nanofacials, whether it's microcurrent, if you exfoliate mm. the skin and get the blood flow going with the vacuum, you're going to, that, that is the beautiful precursor to, to so many things. Um, even a chemical peel, I'll do a micro, one pass micro and a retinol or one pass micro and a little bit of a cell. Um, there's so many things you can do. Micro is just the hammer and the toolbox for the carpenter, but it's certainly not every, I mean, it's, it's a very valuable tool, but it's not the only tool. So mm -hmm. I think in today's modern um, aesthetics, it's how well the clinician or the esthetician understands how to utilize all of her tools together in, in, in a creative, sorry, in a crafted service that's customized just for that client. I love that. I love that. And, you know, Rita asked, you know, are the post kits full size or sample? Oh, uh, good question. I, that would be executive size. Uh, I would, yeah, I would want to go with the full size, you know, and keep track of, yeah, of their purchases so we can remind them that they're running low, you know, um, but I think that full size is probably the best, don't you think? Yes, and of course, the, the example I gave was um, the travel kit. So okay. they, weren't, they weren't full size, but they were teasers, but they were large enough to where you could actually use that kit for 48 hours after each one of those micro glows. So there was enough product to be used post-care 
to make sure and ensure safety for that client um, that, okay, over the next three facials, you know, this little travel kit is going to be your post, your post care kit. But I would never let someone go home. If they purchased a series of three, I would definitely do retail, full size retail. The post kit would act as a, as a 48 hour, 24 to 48 hour post peel kit. Um, mm -hmm. But I would, I would certainly not let them go away without a proper retail, you know, a good cleanser, a good sunscreen, a good, you know, serum, a good vitamin C, whatever you guys have. And you could put that, like I used to do these little agreements with my clients Ooh. if I did, I did, because it was like a little commitment agreement. Like we're in this together. I'm your skin fitness coach yep. and you're, you know, receiving, but the, the, the treatments, but you know, if we're going to do a series of, of diamond tip microcurrent, well, I did crystals then, but you know, you, you know, it's required for you to purchase this because Absolutely. I want you to have, and it was just an understanding. Like I stood behind it and I was confident in saying it. So they were like, okay, <laughs> you know, I mean, they, you know, they trust you, you know, we've earned their trust. So it's not like, like we're trying to just sell them something to sell them something. I mean, vitamin C, I mean, I hands down, everyone should be on that. Like I love vitamin C, but anyway, I think that, um, I don't want to go down a rabbit hole of that. No, but I think, I think the consultation is what biggie. I think, I think there's yeah. two, two areas that need a lot of exploring in our beauty schools and sorry, not in our beauty schools because they're doing a great job. I mean, there's only so much they can do in 600 hours, but I think what I've seen in the last Less. 20 years, <laughs> I've seen estheticians pull the cart before the horse. So they, they get the person in the bed and they do the facial and then they're doing the consult after instead of like fully dressed, I'm going to sit with you. I'm going to go over all the products you brought in. I'm going to get to know you. I'm going to listen. I'm going to open my ears, take tons of notes. I'm going to ask you questions. You're going to do all the talking. And then would I'm going to get you guys like another me. webinar? Okay. <laughs> Who's coming to the summit? Because I, I mean, if you guys, would you guys want to hear like how to do an effective consultation? Would that like be like an amazing training? It's so yes. easy when, when they're, when you're just, when you know the way yes. to do it, I see people doing it backwards and they don't know yes, better. Kidding. It's kind of like, if you don't close that retail sale before you rebook, you have closed their wallets. I cannot tell you that is like, that was the biggest aha for me when I learned that message from a guru in the industry. Um, and she said that I was like, Oh my gosh, she's right. Because if you start rebooking, that appointment three to four weeks out. Then you try to backpedal and say, okay, so can I, can I get your retail? Oh, no, no, no. They're already in the future. Oh, they're no, already, they're out the door. They're picking they're up their the kids door. from soccer. They're, right. they're, 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 soccer. Done. they're on the van. They're in the van. Yeah. That is exactly right. So it's just knowing the, the kernels, the little pearls of wisdom from people that you and I have learned from. You know, I've learned little secrets. But yes, I think we get them into bed too soon. And we don't get I do to too. first because there's <laughs> other, you know, because I think, I think a lot of estheticians think like time is money. We just want to get them in and not, I think spending that time on the front side, especially in that initial consultation, exactly, yeah. it's the initial one, right? I mean, we know them already for this. I mean, for these quick summertime treatments, this is a way to re-stimulate your base. You already yeah, have Maddie. your customers. Um, yeah. This isn't something I would do for a first timer. Um, I would do what I call the consultation facial, which is a microderm. It is, it is definitely a micro, but it's, a, it's an hour and maybe an hour, 15 minutes, but there's no massage, not at all. There's a lot. I, of I love that. I love that because here's, I really think in and out 30 minutes. I love what you said um, earlier about, you know, um, 45 minutes or, or longer or on the table. Or lowers your chances of selling retail. I by thought that 50%, was by 50%, by 50%. Yeah. 60 minutes or more and you can, it really, it. they're like, yeah, they, you got to get them an Uber. They need a like, <laughs> <laughs> we can do that now. Right. But and a prescription, make sure you give a prescription that will increase your sales by 50% by having a written prescription. And I think we forget that too. Danielle is such a, a wealth of information. Um, what questions do you have for Danielle on the diamond tip treatment or just protocol, like anything right now that's coming to your mind where you just want to pick her brain to say like, wow, like 
Anything at all. Yeah, anything. Go, go for it. Um, we're going to get into the price in just a minute. You're going to be blown away, by the way. Um, and because I will, I'm going to share what I spent on my microderm and I'm going to tell everyone what I did to buy my first one. It was <laughs> insane. And then, um, oh, the vermilion border and the eyes. I'm assuming yes. you can so, do that. Oh, yes. So we have a tip called the detail tip. And um, I don't have a picture of it. I have a little one right here. Okay. But do you, um, but you, in your additional education, mm -hmm. you walk these estheticians through all of the things that you've, like all your tips and tricks. Do you have any recorded um, trainings on techniques? I do, I do. Um, like so I have skin a, and Oh yeah, I did a DVD, I did a download called Micro Peeling for Safety and Results because uh, I was seeing all kinds of disasters. I was seeing people putting glycolic acid on after a microderm, which is something you never wanna do. Um, I was seeing all kinds of things. And so I decided, okay, I'm going to write, I'm going to create this training and I taught it at, at trade shows all over the country uh, for Skin Inc. I did articles for, for Skin Inc. And, but I, I'm going to Hickory in November at the Southern Salon Conference. It's, a, it's two CEUs if you need to get CEUs for your class. So I'll be teaching it there, but I do have a download called Micro Peeling for Safety and Results. And it really goes into the nitty gritty of, hey, don't apply this acid before, apply it after. And How do they find that? Um, they... That's on my website. Oh, um, which one? Enlightenedskincare.com. So enlightened. Okay. So e uh, enlightenedskincare.com. Okay, that's a free training. And then, how do they find you through? Well, that one's not free, but oh we, no, that's not free. That's actually a paid download. It's an hour long of footage, so you keep that download and you can rewatch it. And it was filmed in your perspective. So if you have an iPad or something, you can actually practice with it. And um, it's in your perspective, not the perspective of watching a movie. But it's actually as if you were doing it yourself. So it's easier to learn from. So how do we find you on Skin Smooth? Ah, no. so yes, on the I will. My telephone number is on the SkinSmoothPro.com website. That's skinsmoothpro.com and my cell phone number is there at the uh, on the uh, contact us page i'm happy to speak with anybody that is my cell phone you are welcome to call me um and con and get in touch with me and ans ask any questions that you have i've sold so many machines over the last 10 years and helped estheticians from all over the country medical spas resort spas indian casinos and solo estheticians, which is my heart. Um, so, Me too. Yep. I mean, so, we are such a noble profession and so accessible to the consumer and do so much good to the consumer. I really want to help the esthetician who is in business by herself do very, very well. I want to help her do that. So, that so tell us what this special is of this $500 value. Okay. Well, yes, it's practically $500. Um, i am sure okay. we can it's $250 credit for face and body tips. So and in addition, free shipping and free shipping, that's where it so comes that's, in. That's the $50. So you get free shipping. You get a, um, a phone coaching with me. We can do that via Skype or FaceTime if you are not in Northern California. And that will be for an hour. Um, and I will go through all the nitty gritty with you, um, all the little tips and tricks and, um, also, we have a $250 credit. So when you purchase a Skin Smooth Pro, you're going to get a fine, medium, and coarse face tip. You're going to get a nose tip. You're going to get the detail tip. And you're going to get some body tips. But we want you to have extra tips. So you can spend $250 choosing to get extras of whatever you'd like. If you want okay. more fine tips, medium tips, nose tips, whatever you want, it's $250 to spend. Um, and free shipping. Okay. Do we, do we reveal what the investment is for this? Absolutely. Diamond. We're very proud. Confident um, the bit here. <laughs> um, this is a seven pound, um, beautiful device. Okay. Um, 
It's modeled after the most expensive diamond tip on the market. We even, the casing of this device comes from Everett, Washington, and it's the overhead compartment material from airlines. So if you're flying, the next time you put something in the overhead, it's that anti-vibrational material. So every detail of this machine, it's so, super quiet. There's two medical oscillating motors. It's well built. It, it's built to never break down. It should last your lifetime. It's $34.95, $3,495, um, which was really, for a company to make a machine like this at that price, we should have a lot of expensive disposables for you to come back and purchase, but we don't. Um, even when you come back to purchase tips and filters, it's extremely low. And we, you know, when we first started the company, we really weren't thinking about that. We weren't manufacturers. We were, we were clinicians. We were industry mm. professionals. We didn't, we didn't have MBAs. So now I understand why other devices cost double of our device. I know why, you know, because, we don't make a lot on the back end, um, but we do offer excellent education. We're very happy with our business model. The people who own this company are exceptional people. They, um, they do very, very well. They love that this design is it's near perfect. It doesn't break down and they're, they're happy to offer this device at this price. So that's 33,495. So, okay. I'm going to tell you guys what I spent on my first, <laughs> It was like my big, first big pur purchase as an esthetician. I spent 10 grand. Yeah, that's what I spent on my mother's on my credit card. Life. Okay, so <laughs> I went, so here's me, I'm thinking I'm like this hotshot esthetician and <laughs> I go to the trade show and I bring a Vogue magazine. I'll just use, oh. I bring a Vogue magazine because it had the fold over cover, remember that? It had the double cover. And so I would go to, to the machines and they're all crystal then because diamond, you guys are ahead of your time, but I would go and I would hold down that device for like five seconds to see how many pages it would go through. Oh, and then manually one because I thought more is better, right? Who's who thinks or who thought more was better? Like, you know what I mean? Like, as a new esthetician, I really did. And so I'm like, so ten thousand dollars for my very first wow, manual eye, and it was a workhorse. Yeah, but it spit crystals all over the place. So, you know, I just love how I just love everything that I learned from you today. Thank you oh, so thank much. You, Did you guys learn something? I I was... please don't make me be the only one in thirty <laughs> years in the industry, and you know, like wow, I learned something new about. Um, you oh, know, Claire Hodgkins treatments. raised her hand. Claire um, I think she was saying me too. Oh, if you have a, thanks, Claire. <laughs> oh, thank you. Thank you, Crystal. Thank you. What a great opportunity yeah, to be able to too, speak Claire. to you. See, thanks. <laughs> <laughs> thanks for taking a hit with me because it, it's like, it's really true. You know, you think you get like someone tells you something and then it sticks and then you just, you think it's true. But now that you've broken it down, it makes sense. You know, like, you know, the vacuum, the sodium um, chloride crystals, like, you know, the mechanical and the chemical. And now you're just making it, you know, it's just mechanical and it's safer and it's yeah. safe to do in summertime. And so I, I'm excited. I hope you guys are inspired to potentially have a new summertime treatment for yourself and something that can be done all year long. Really. People love it. People love it. They still love it. And, you know, your biggest market, Maxine, is what age group, would you say? Or women that 40 to 60, or what is it? Because they all grew up on microderm. They love it. They want it. Yeah. Um, you know, uh, Yania, um, I think that, um, no comment on the recommended price, that's going to be your demographic. So you kind of want to do a little bit of market research there to kind of find out what your market will bear. And... Um, you know, to come up with some really good, healthy pricing. I don't want you to undercut yourself. So we used a formula up on the screen just as a, a sample, like just to kind of show you, you know, as a sample formula, but it's not necessarily a formula that you should use for your demographics. I never would want you to get paid under what you're worth or what no. your market will bear. I think we should really think to ourselves, what is our cost per treatment okay. and what are we worth per hour? 
well, what are we worth? And also what will the market bear? You know, I mean, we have to, you know, it's, we have to really be mindful of that. I don't necessarily think that you need to go look up what other estheticians are charging and go under it. I don't think that at all, but what kind of value add, what I loved was you priced and that's kind of how I coach too. If it's a yeah. single price, it's always going to be more Absolutely. expensive. Yes. But make whatever you really want to earn too for your time in that 30 minutes, um, your um, package price. That's exactly right. That's exactly so the, right. So the, yeah. the single price is like just bonus. <laughs> you know, that's bonus. We're, we're not really encouraging that, but that's also sending a marketing message and enticing those clients to purchase that package. Like, you know, you'll get more for your money if you do a package and better results you know, and better results. Honestly. Yeah. Yep. I, I'm dying. When can I get a treatment from you? Do I have to wait till October? I guess I do. Oh, uh, but no, yeah. I'm not going to be over your way until then, but I would, no, it would be an honor. Summit. It would be an honor to do that for you. <laughs> okay. Maybe before <laughs> that would be good. So I'm all glowy. <laughs> for that. That would be great. But thanks for joining us thank live you. today. Thank, thank you. Thank you. Uh, the Pleasure. replay will get that out hopefully tonight. I know some people want to rewatch it. And if you have any questions, you can reach out to Danielle. Her phone number is on the skinsmoothpro.com website. Thank you so much. Thank you, Maxine. All right. Have a beautiful rest of your day. Will do. Thank okay. you. Bye-bye. Bye.